Welcome to the lesson on how to back up your drivers before you complete a Windows reformat. This lesson is brought to you by itsachat.com. The tests shown in these videos have been tried and proven to be true. Let's begin. You will need to use a utility to back up your drivers. This video will show you how to unzip and install a driver backup utility to your desktop, and then use that utility to back up your drivers. The utility we will use is called the Driver Genius. Right click on the zip file and select open. A window will come out. Click extract to. Now another window comes out and asks you for a path directory where you will be saving these files. We will save our package to the desktop. Choose desktop and then select OK. Once you have done this, you will see the package done zipped and placed on your desktop. The file here is called Driver Genius EXE. Double click on this file to start the installation operation. Choose your options and click Next. Choose a full installation. Choose to have an icon placed on your desktop. Select Install. You will be prompted to restart your computer to complete the installation. Click Finish and wait for your computer to restart. Welcome back. Let's continue. You would have restarted your computer and found the new utility installed onto your desktop. Let's double click the newly installed application and use it to back up our computer's drivers. We are going to register for the trial version of this program. You must purchase this software if you plan on keeping it, but for now we can use it for the next 15 days. We will click on the button that says Try. A daily tip appears. Let's uncheck where it says Show daily tip at startup and click on the OK button. Here you can see our newly downloaded driver backup utility. Across the top of the utility are your options. On the left here, you can see the different areas of drivers. We are going to check them to select each one. Then we will click on the button that says Backup. The application searches your computer for your drivers. It reports that it found nine driver devices. It lists them for you beside the categories list. Check all the drivers once again to prepare them for backup. We are now going to create a folder to back up our drivers to. Click Browse. Go to Desktop and click OK. You will now see the path to your desktop in the backup location. Right click on Desktop. Select New Folder. To create a new folder on your desktop, rename this folder Any Folder. Go back to your backup driver utility and browse to the new folder you just created. Select that folder as the folder you want to backup your drivers to. Remember, we will need to eventually move these files to another disk, as the disk we are backing them up from is to be reformatted in a later lesson. So now that we are certain that we have the correct folder to back up to, we are ready to continue. Click the button that says Start Backup and click that button Good. You will see a progress meter. Let's move the utility and make sure that it is working. Oh yes, there it goes. Now would not be a good time to go get yourself a fresh drink of water. 
The time it takes to back up all the drivers will depend on the speed of your computer, as well as how many different driver files you are using, and we are just about done. You will get a message that the backup is complete. Click OK. Click on the red X in the top right corner to exit out of the backup utility. Double click on your any folder folder, and you will see your driver files displayed nicely inside. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next lesson. Goodbye, and happy computing from your friends at itsachat.com.